Welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how to graph um, our example from our notes in GeoGebra. And of course, the first thing you need to do oopsies, is enter the function and graph it. And there you see, um, I don't have a t, I have an x, because for GeoGebra, you need to use x's and y's. So p of x equals negative 16x squared plus 96x. And now I'm going to pinch in, so that's I'm pinching the vertical axis together with my fingers to get it to squish while moving this around. And I want to get just the right view, so bear with me while I kind of move things around. Right there I zoomed um, by putting my fingers together along the horizontal axis and separating them. And now I'm just adjusting because the example, we're interested in the time interval between two and three seconds. And that's a pretty good view right there. I'm going to adjust it a little bit more, actually. I think I like this view better. Perfect. And now, from here, I don't really like these grid lines. So I'm going to go in the settings and grid type. I'm just going to go major grid lines. And then I'm also going to change another thing in my settings. On yours, you might have, let me go back here, distance or length. On yours, you probably have it set to 0.1. And I already changed this before the video, and that's that's pretty bad. It, on automatic. So I'm going to take that off of automatic again and go ahead and change that to the number one to get this view. And then finally, the font size is a little small. So under general font size, I'm going to kick that up to 28. And now this is a lot more legible. Hopefully this graph and this tutorial helps you work in our class with GeoGebra, the technology of choice for this semester.